from Jen's perspective in her Colossus, a heavily armored battle exo that trades agility for massive firepower. As you can see, her two friends have joined us. Renata is playing in the Ranger, a faster moving javelin with a focus on precision. Scylla is also playing a Colossus, but with a completely different loadout, one that focuses on close quarter combat, and we'll see his flamethrower a bit later on. He also has a totally different appearance with that sweet, sweet red speed stripe. Ours is an unfinished world, a world abandoned by its gods, the Shapers. It's also a reactive world. Here you can see our jets are overheating, but we can fly through this waterfall to cool them off. Owen, what's the plan here? Picking up loads of scars nearby. Take a look around the area, but uh, be careful. Owen is our cipher and guide for the mission and will provide valuable intel. The Scars are relentless invaders who crave the ancient power of the Shaper technology, and they're in a constant conflict with the Freelancers. Up ahead we have a Scar Watchtower. Our squad should probably tread lightly here so they don't call for reinforcements. Oh, we could just blow it up. Look at all the weapons! Oh, and the, and the turrets! Better move quickly. There is acid here, but not much. They're going to be making it farther in. Right. Checking out the scar camp some more. Missions can be joined in progress through freelancer reinforcements. Our fourth squad member, Catherine, is about to join us. Catherine joined us in the storm, a glass cannon with powerful elemental attacks and light armor. Catherine was taking a nap at launch, and while all her friends level 30, she's only level 1. But that's okay, because in Anthem, friends of any level can play together to earn experience and great rewards. Train of this acid gunk leading down. Follow it, and we should find the source. Hang on, something isn't right. Okay, so that Titan was way too powerful for our squad, at least for today, so it was wise to avoid him. But emergent world events just like the Titan can happen throughout the world of Anthem. And it's a really important point, because what it means is, every time you go out and explore the world, you'll have a totally different experience that yields different rewards.